Good day friends, today we are going uh, to check some eBay listing for uh, fossils. Because, you know, it's Fossil Friday, Paleo Friday, whatever you want to call it. Um, so this is, I'm gonna try to post this on Friday. Um, I'm recording this, uh, this on Tuesday or Thursday or something like that. So, uh, yeah. Uh, so on eBay, I don't know who in their uh, who would fucking buy fossils from eBay? Like, never buy anything fucking worth more than like 60 bucks on eBay. Yeah, perhaps some fucking shits from r slash paleontology. Man, that subreddit is, is toxic. So, and we got our first fake right in here. So let's take a look at this bad boy. One piece. Divernus, T-Rex, Dinosaur Fossil, Jurassic, Cretaceous. Alright, so it's a fucking trans time fossil. 113 million years old. Alright. So this is definitely not a fucking T-Rex. And would you look at that? Completely identical one. Oh look, <laughs> another T-Rex, which is the same as this T-Rex. And a rare carnivore dinosaur. Wow, we got him twice too. So they, these are just some fakes that look nothing like fossils. Yeah, so... Uh, Okay. It doesn't look even like bones, it just looks like fucking sticks. And we got him twice here again. Now this one actually says resin miners fossil. So please these don't fucking lie. Uh, so yeah we got him twice again. But this time uh, you can actually find this type of dinosaur for real. Of course not in this quality, and it's it's kind of good that you don't find any this quality because I don't think anyone anybody wants these fucking stick figures. So we got some broken trilobite tails, teeth from a mosasaur, belemite, a unique beetle. All right, all right, this is a good price. There's one bit on it. Uh, amber with insects is so, so it's quite expensive by the way uh, 25 check rounds is roughly uh, 1 euro uh, so <laughs> this right here 6000 fucking crowns is, uh, is a lot of money yeah you could, it would be half of your um, payment from work, so yeah, it ain't that good. But these are quite cheap, but they're, they were posted uh, only a few hours ago. Yeah, so we got a lot of belemites, a large fossil, mosasaur, right? Really badly damaged trial by yeah, beautiful my ass. Look at the fucking crack right here, man. Damn. Like, like, other than that, it's pretty nice, but the crack... I wouldn't be too sure on the longevity of this, because, you know, it's gonna peel off, probably. Oh, well. Insect stone. Wow. Uh, sometimes, people just put insects in resin and say, like, Man, this is a fucking amber with a, with a fucking huge ass scorpion. Well, it, it's not, it's just a modern scorpion, you know. In resin, it has been colored. But, um. Damn, this is a really nicely preserved fucking Bellamite. Wow. Another fake, another resin. Fish, fish. Ah, oh, here we go. So, compared to these. 
uh, these fake ones. You can see the real one right here. This one is really nice though. Right. And they're one of the more common uh, fossils in their entirety. So you can see the price in the US and you can see the price in France. So it's uh, it's it's really expensive, but um, I'm not finding any egg fakes. Wow, that's, that's weird. Normally they're out. So this is a hmm. There's something off. Jurassic World. Everything with Jurassic World. Yep. Yep. Pick, pick, pick. So, alright, we're gonna take a, a look at this fake OV Raptor. Yeah, fuck it. The fuck is this shit? Oh, my keyboard is fucked. God damn it. Alright then. So my keyboard got fucked and I forgotten how to... Ah, no, it doesn't work. There we go. Yeah, this is quite a well-known topic. So we take a look at the uh, uh, cast. It's still pretty expensive, but this looks pretty fishy. And these are uh, never buy a Sigmasaurus and a Never fucking do it. 90% of them are fake. You see, you see them in the background. Don't fucking do it. Mm -hmm. this, this appears to be a fake as well. Uh, so the eggs are really easy to, to, to fuck up. Um, anything with the words Jurassic World, don't fucking even, don't consider it. There's something off about this, which uh, perhaps the with a low price for a perfectly uh, perfectly preserved pterosaur. I don't know. Oh, he's <laughs> he's here again. So uh, there's another rag. Yeah, there's something off about this. I don't want to say that most things are fake. I don't like to uh, fucking uh, point and say this is fake, but like... Yeah. There's something fucking fishy about the eggs. Don't, don't, just don't buy shit from eBay like this. Right? There are plenty of conventions. There is no need. You're gonna meet some great people there. So... Like, why the fuck would you do that? Like, last time I was on a convention, it was around Christmas time. And I was buying a drive bike and I saw a, a piece of... piece of fossilized wood. And I was like, hey man, I'm, uh, can I have that too? And he was like, you know what? Have it for free. So I got a fucking free piece of... Uh, Again, this is fake. You can find like 30 of these. Fucking bullshit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> this is fuck six vintage replica fossils. Now, when they say replica in the fucking name, 
I, 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 I can live with that, it's fucking good, like not everybody can afford some crazy ass fossils. These are really nice. I don't know why they are free of fucking same butterflies and two of them frogs. But like, I have a replica. Uh, it's a uh, rather huge ammonite. It's about the size of my hand. And it's nice, I have it um, like uh, hanged like a decoration. Replicas have their place, but when it's this, it's fucking bullshit. I don't. I don't think anybody would fall for this shit. It doesn't even look convincing, it just looks shit. Right? So if we take this, uh, this dude, and we search up, uh, uh, so this would be a um, attack for Dromiosaur and Dromi... Ah, fuck. So I'm sorry I can't type. <laughs> Fucking there we go. So um let's find one that's in stone. Um seems that ah, there we go. So this one's really uh nice nicely dug up. It takes fucking hours upon hours to do such a fine job of lifting the fossil off the rock as much as possible. I tried to do it with my uh, trilobites, and man, it was fucking painful. Um, uh, do, can we find some better examples? Alright, so Dromeo Sword, like Black Rocky Mountain Dinosaur. So, I know it's a really bad resolution, but if you squint real hard, you see that it looks nothing. Fucking, uh, it looks nothing like this. Yeah, it's it's easy to f to spot fakes like these. And like if you're buying a trial bite, they can be fake. But if you're uh, Shopping for uh, uh, the uh, end game, the, 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 the fucking big collector's items. Like, all right, this one that looks good. It could be a fake, but uh, it could not be. So, uh, if 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 you find another one of these in the listing below, you know it's fake. Um, worst things to spot a fake are probably the eggs, fossils, sometimes trilobites. Uh, never, never purchase a stomach stone. I'm gonna show you. Uh, uh, stomach stone. My grammar is the level of a five-year-old. So I'm sorry. Right? These are stomach stones. Um, here are in the. They are used in jewelry. Sometimes, but that's not what we are looking at. Oh, um, sorry. Um, so, what we're interested in in these three? So, a stomach stone gonna search it up real quick for you so you know I'm not making shit up stomach stone uh, for so wiki there we go so the, so this is the fucking science ass name yeah okay. Who the fuck would go and take a fucking rock and say, oh, this is a gastrolyph thing. Yeah, fucking stomach stone sounds 50 times better. Alright, so migration, identification. Yeah, so the, for it to be considered a uh, gastrolyph, 
it has to have three main um, three main features. So So f the first one is the stone must be unlike the rock found in the ge uh, geological vicinity. Secondly, it should be rounded and polished. And the third one is uh, it must be found with the force of the dinosaur. Uh, dinosaur which ingested it. All right, this is the most important one. Because if you look at this one, there's a stomach stone fossil, 100% genuine. All right, so let's look into description. Dinosaur reptiles, unpolished, brand new, unused. Well, I don't know how the fuck you would use it, but uh, oh yeah, I'm selling my used fucking stomach stone. I I shed it out yesterday, so I'm selling it for, the, for somebody to reuse it. It is from a dinosaur. Alright, these stones are retained in the muscle. Alright, so it's stones. This is an actual specimen. This is the picture ones. Alright, so I, the thing you want to have is. You want the name of the fossil it was discovered next to. All right, because I can take any Polish truck and say this is a fucking stomach stone. It was found, and then just go on Wikipedia, search some fucking geological shit, and say, mm -hmm. so I found it here, and uh, yeah, it's polished and round. Give me money, but you can't make up the fucking fossil. Preferably, there should be a picture of the fossil with the stone fucking next to it, at least, or something like that. But such. Yeah, I just just repeat. They just repeat the shit uh, from Wikipedia. Uh, Wikipedia, Wikipedia. Fuck, can't speak today. But um, yeah. So, so this is fucking bullshit. It can be genuine, but there's no fucking evidence. Like, like fucking suck my dick, you fucking scam shit. If you're gonna say 100% genuine, I want some fucking facts. Oh, we are just one centimeter. Fuck you. Alright. Let's take a look at some pictures then. Alright. So they're mainly smooth. And they're... They're really shiny. Alright. There's not much shine. Or it is a little bit... There are really big indents in this, but it has some age. Alright, are there any more... Any more guides? In Polish or water? Also, so fair patterns. Also, will be deposited outside the skeleton deposits. Air filled bones, which would cause carcasses and blah blah blah. No, not sufficient to allow you to escape. Plus, if you don't have the exact same um, the exact same fossil, oh, the, the exact same fucking fossil, then how do how do we know that? All right. So if it's a stomach stone, um, how do we know it's not from a fucking fish or from a from a fucking ostrich or some shit? Hmm? Yeah, you can't fucking tell. I really doubt this guy just fucking uses some complex methods to fucking tell the, the pattern of wear on this exact rock. Right? So, never fucking try to buy shit like this from eBay. It, it will never fucking work. And you're probably gonna get scammed. Plus, the shipping is fucking horrendous. You're gonna fucking pay half of your fucking. You're gonna sell your house for a fucking fossa and it comes in the fucking mail under your bridge. And then it's gonna be broken in half. Alright, so never fucking buy shit like this and some collector's item from fucking eBay. Go on a convention, go uh, go on some fuck. Just go on a site that tells you your local paleontologist, get in touch, read some fucking books and contact those people. Anything. But fucking eBay. Uh, so yeah, I think this is gonna do it for today's video. Uh, so 
If you enjoyed, I, I would greatly appreciate it if you would uh, subscribe or hit that like button. Uh, yeah, so n next Friday um, I'm planning on doing a, a, a video on a fucking dead project. Uh, one of the dudes from the Paleo Wiki uh, made a carbonivorous uh, game simulator thingy. It's a long dead, but uh, I got the working version of it. So uh, we'll check that out. There are some nifty little features. And uh, yeah, so I, I don't know if I said it uh, last time or in the channel update. But um, so I'm gonna be releasing one video, maybe two, three, uh, every two weeks. Uh, I, I got school, so uh, there's not much time for this. But I'm gonna try to keep uh, the fossil slash paleontology Fridays and one video of normal gameplay. So yeah, I hope you enjoy this. Uh, have a great, have a great and amazing day, guys.